Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Womicorn Gaming. Sorry I haven't made any videos for a while. I was quite busy, my internet went off and all that shit. Um, what I bring you today is an interesting game. It's called... Wizorb. It's kind of like Brick Breaker in a sense, and it's pretty cheap on Steam. I think it was about $3 or something like that. I'll show you guys some gameplay footage, I guess. Let's start here. So here it is. Wizard. The point of this game is like Brick Breaker. I have to delete all those other blocks. Okay, that's new. Uh, I'm in a bonus stage. This is excellent. I've never been in one. So these items that I'm getting, they give me some bonuses. Like this yellow one gives me money. I don't know what the heart gives. Maybe extra life? Yep, it gives me an extra life. And I have magic powers, which I'll use later on once I'm out of this bonus stage. Oh yeah. There we go. It should send me back to the normal stage, and I'll show you guys what some of that magic power does. If you press it on time like that, uh, it gives you a boost. Which is quite useful in clearing out a bunch of blocks at the same time. Oh my god. Oh man. That stupid monster was in my way. I didn't realize that. Ah! Greed! Greed made me fail. Just realized I'm back to one life again. That sucks. Wow. Wow. I missed. Probably, I'm really, really bad at this game. That's not the way I meant it to go. Nope. Okay, now that just one more block. Oh, there we go. So once you're through a stage, what you basically do is you keep going until it finishes and then uh, you sort of get teleported to this little village that you're supposed to save. Because uh, it's kind of destroyed, they give you an option to buy back a bunch of stuff. And yeah, that's pretty much the idea of Wizard. There's not much gameplay except this, I guess, and it's kind of fun because it's not very strong. Oh, I think I failed there. But yeah, let's get back to the village and I'll show you guys the village instead. So this is the village where stuff is kind of destroyed, right? Um, you can talk to them. Like, this is one house that I just recreated. I'll go enter it now. So here's the guy that I helped. I gave him some money to put his house back up and he gave me a key apparently. Well these other people also need help. Like this guy over here, he needs money. Yeah. I don't ha even have money for it. And this building, I don't know what these all these buildings are but... Yeah that's generally the point. 
you help out with the village and eventually one day all this is gonna be back and I'm not sure how you win but maybe once it all gets back you get to fight a final boss or something like that but that's the general idea I have in my head and you can also travel here this is where I had the battle thingy so yeah there are probably more areas than this and that's about it for this game guys I'll see you guys next time